What's going on, y'all? This is B. Taylor, the DIY channel. And this particular video is concerning the circuit breaker board where one of the circuits actually caught on fire. Um, what I'm showing you is our full circuit breaker board where we have the main power and then, as you know, you have little circuits, uh, 20 amp, 15 amps, whatever they are to go to each section of the house. If you look at this one, this is an older one. There was one just above it that recently failed. And so what I wanna show you is what it actually looks like. Um, first, the symptoms. Um, in this room, we actually had a, a funny smell. It actually was a combination of burnt um, insulation for the wire and ammonia. It's very strange. Looking it up on YouTube, um, they, you know, there were different videos that suggested that you might have an electrical circuit that was on either getting ready to burn and be on fire or has already burned. Um, and that could be in the case of outlets, um, light switches or anything that's a, that's connected to the electrical grid. So we started looking like crazy for every single outlet, every single switch in, in this room, couldn't find it. Um, but what we did notice is that one of the rooms um, in the house ended up losing power. So we came here, we checked it out, the circuit breaker tripped and it, it went back off. So we turned it back on. Later on, maybe a week later, it was still on, but the, there was no power to it. And so I was like, well, what's going on? So I ended up having to take this apart. So there are a bunch of screws here on either edge. Took that apart and I looked at that particular uh, circuit breaker. And this is what I found. This thing, the white's not supposed to be there, but if you could look at it, it's burned pretty bad. This is what it looks like normally. This is a brand new circuit. Uh, this is a 20 amp circuit breaker. This is a 15 amp. It's obviously old, but you have to be careful because obviously you want to turn off the main power. But the real problem there is the actual wire that's going to the circuit. It was so frayed. And it was the insulation, um, the plastic insulation that was surrounding it. It burned off and the actual wire burned off too. So I had to pull it down even further, clean it up and connect it to the new circuit. So it was pretty bad. This is just another symptom that I did not see on YouTube. I wanted to let you guys know just in case you're coming across something similar. Obviously, this one's old, so depending on how much power we put through it, how much current goes across, may come across that same issue again. Hopefully, this was helpful for you. Um, if you like this video, please click like, subscribe, leave a comment, and look at all the other videos that we have because there's a, a lot of other DIYs that uh, may be helpful for you. Till next time, talk to you later. Thanks.